Well, during the summer months, the Sioux Falls School District offers free meals to anyone under the age of 18. That program has now wrapped up, and as Kelloland Sarah McDonald explains, numbers were lower than expected. Hunger doesn't end just because the school year does. That's where the district's summer food program comes into play. On average, the district served about 2,200 meals per day during the program, which was less than last year. And some of the reasoning behind that is we were offering uh, summer academy uh, for students four days a week last year, where this year it was only three days a week. So we knew that those counts would be down. Anderson says another reason she thinks numbers were lower is because meals had to be eaten on site, rather than families being able to take them home like in the year before. We kind of expected that. Uh, we were hoping that we could have served more because that's what we're here for. We always want to help serve our kids. Out of the nine sites offering free meals, she says Hayward Elementary and Terry Redland Elementary were some of the busiest. I think partly uh, we only had one west side open site for that purpose. And then on the east side, we did some daycares picked up on coming in and visiting because they knew that uh, it was available to them. Uh, and some families that were just in the area that live there and could walk it easily. Now that the summer program has wrapped up, families are encouraged to sign up for free and reduced meals ahead of the upcoming school year. It's going to save you money out of your pocketbook. On average, it's going to be about $65 a month for lunch for a child. And so parents need to be planning for that. In Sioux Falls, Sarah McDonald, Killaland News. Anderson says right now they are working on preparing sites and getting in food orders. They are aware there may be supply chain issues. To apply for free and reduced meals, we provided the link with this story on Kelloland.com.